Alrighty, now. Ooh, Rome. I like this track here. Let's do it, y'all. Let's do it. Classic sports car race, race two. Circuit de Roma. Yeah, they do keep you from, like, putting little granny cars in this, though. I mean, I guess if you turn them all the way to the max, you could win. Like that old Beetle, I might be able to win with this, but it'd be hard. Very hard. But they kind of restrict you by making you only be able to use sports hard tires. That really makes it, you know, to where you don't have an advantage that way. <laughs> oh man, y'all are grannying. Grannying. Ooh. Corvette Coupe. Come on now. I expect more from a Corvette. Come on now. Already second. The Ferrari once again is leading. This baby sure does smoke the tires. <laughs> Here, Ferrari. Oh, dang, he left me on that corner. Yeah, I got him on the straights, though. Sad for him. <laughs> sad for him. And it's sad for me when I hit the wall. It's so sad. I like this track. I can't help but like it. It's not very long either. Pretty short. They're keeping up though, man. That Ferrari's, it means business, doesn't it? Of course, what can you expect from a Ferrari? Good old El Camino. I've always liked these old cars. You don't see too many left, though, sadly. <laughs> Seems like I like the later models more, though. Like the 70, like the 72s and such. We've got a little bit of a gap between us and the Ferrari now little bit of a cushion. All right, careful here. Yeah, very nice, very nice. Four seconds ahead. <laughs> well, well, well. Yeah, I can't wait till we get to the, till I really start reeling into money and can buy some more cars, you know, some more cool cars, some faster ones. You gotta keep in mind, this is my first time really playing this game. I've already gotten a lot further than I did during my practice, or, you know, during like my little preview that I did before. Oh yeah, beautiful, beautiful. Still looks real high off the ground though. It's like the front's higher than the rear. <laughs> I didn't even look at the weight distribution. We want most of our money back. After we win this next race, we'll be really close. Really close to it. Oh, Silverstone. That's not my favorite track. That's their favorite, though. I can tell you that already. Definitely their favorite track. Hey, good. How many times have I done this track? If I keep doing it much more, I won't need a driving line. <laughs> this time, we got an A-type 
Jaguar coupe first. Oh, and even a Pontiac Firebird is third. Neato. 84 degrees, cloudy with rain. Uh oh. Not so sure about this. Is it going to be raining for real? That'll make the race more interesting if it is. It doesn't look like it's raining. They lied to me. They said it was rainy. La, la, la. Well, you know, that's what meteorologists sometimes do, you know. They say it's supposed to be, you know, like a 80% chance of thunderstorms and it's just sunny all day. Nah. God's in control of the weather, you know. I mean, we just, as good as you, I mean, even with all the technology and everything, you still can be wrong. I mean, that's what's so interesting about weather. That actually is, is what I wanted to be. Before I wanted to become a teacher, I wanted to be a meteorologist. And I still really track hurricanes and stuff. Fascinating. Uh, oh yeah, this curve can be troublesome. Oh yeah, man, I can tell such a difference in the handling than before, such a difference. I think if I had these uh, hand, this handling, I would have done much better on that last race on this track with that BMW M3, which I still won. I don't know. I'm really surprised. It's like the computers were waiting on me or something. I didn't really know they did, did that in simulation mode like this. Career mode, simulation mode, whatever you call it. We Fringe of real drive cars are so fun to drive. <laughs> Smoke. Alrighty. Let's see, almost getting to the troublesome corner. And this wasn't it, but somehow I made it troublesome. All right, here we go, though. Here we go. They're way back there. Oh, this curve right here. Yeah, I got you now, curve. You can't treat me. I got you now. Full throttle. Hehe. <laughs> Oh yeah, and y'all are just sucking away. Five seconds. I don't know, they're not doing too bad. Tell you what, I took that curve like 95 in that Skyline GTR. Of course, it may have had better tires than this too, you know. You gotta give this poor El Camino the benefit of the doubt. It's my shadow, isn't it? Stop squealing. Stop squealing. I'll think of all that rubber that you're wasting, car. Rubber, you're burning. Oh, I forgot. It's a good thing about rear wheel drive, though, is you can kind of let off the gas and slow down a little more, and then you can turn kind of where you need to go get your balance right with the front wheel drive you're just going to be out you know you're, you're going out if you break too late or even some four wheel drives like that Lancer Evolution it understeers really heavily yep I'm liking this race Locking it. Yay, we didn't run off the road. Come on, El Camino. Oh, man. Oh, this is a groovy song. <laughs> Look at our river. It's smoke. 
<laughs> the world's getting down. Oh, the Firebird must not be that good. It went down to fifth. Didn't it start at like a third or something? I know it went down some notches. Alright, pay attention. Got this wonderful curve to deal with. Oh man, the brakes are so much better on this car too. That may be another thing that makes such a difference. Those brakes, man, I can tell the difference in them. Alrighty. And voila. Oh yes, y'all. Look at that. And we're not going to wait on them because they're too slow. <laughs> Fourteen thousand. We want most of our, well, three fourths of our credit is back. We had like ninety thousand. And you see, uh, the Firebird did start out third, so it went down a couple notches. Poor thing. Well, everybody, uh, I think I'm about ready for a little break here. So we'll we'll take one little look at our stats, and uh, then that's going to be it for this part. see here oh I want a car why national B class half the stars acquired oh neato huh this is a pretty good little car too hmm what color white or black let's go with black kind of groovy looking black we don't want to use her just yet though that's neat. I'm glad they gave us a car for that. That's nice. So uh, next time we'll uh, we still got quite a bit. There's so much to do on this uh, B on these B events. We still got quite a bit to do. But at any rate, here's where we are, 11% and uh, 24 ends, 24 races, 2.1 hours driving time. 170 mile an hour top speed. Wow, look at that. The most wins is still the RX-7, though. Chevrolet's my favorite dealership now. Hmm, I don't know why they decided that. Did I buy t Did I buy more than one car from Chevrolet? All right, everybody. We're going to stop right here. I want to thank you very much for watching, y'all. And as always, stay awesome.